All right, this is Under the Dome episode four. The, check my description for uh, my schedule. Just want to put that in there. Um, and then let's go. So, uh, how's everybody doing? I'm I'm just hanging out in my room. So I'm also watch some stuff, right? <laughs> okay, so we're watching Under the Dome. Uh, what's her name? Julia found a map in uh, Dale Barbie is a uh, bag and I get it's like a map right and there is some kind of a there's some kind of a legend there's a there's a circle or some, or some area of the of the map um and I think she's gonna go and check it out um don't know what that is but I want to find out what it is but I want to find out what it is uh, also um I've been getting some I've been getting copyright issues from number from the episode three so sorry about that I'm trying to upload it um, I'm gonna try again, and if you if you see it keep popping up, it's because, it, and it keeps getting taken down. I keep trying to get it back up there. I keep I keep taking things out to get it up there, but I will figure it out. I will get it up there, but I'm worried this might come out in on, out of order because I may if it doesn't work out. But I'm trying to get it up there. Just to let you guys know, I'm having copyright issues right now with some of the videos but i will figure it out so if anything disappears from the channel it's not me it's it's being taken down because of copyright issues and i understand i'm gonna figure out where to get it up there though i'll figure it out hopefully <laughs> so let's go to another dumb episode four thank you for um patience and all that understanding and uh, understanding of those uh issues um let's go folks are getting scared you think pulling the gun's gonna reassure them all right all right i don't for wanting answers. We all want to know when this thing's coming down, but this is not helping. Government's left us here to rot. What are you gonna do? Open fire in the crowd? And this? <gasps> all the stress, man. It's so... Oh, man. She's gonna be stuck in there all freaking... all freaking season. You want me to look beautiful? You're starting to act like the old Angie I knew before the dome came down. Act is the key word there. Turn around. Hits him in the head with something. Whack him in the head with something. We do it now, do it now. I'll get her back, right, Angel? Oh, yeah, the scissors. Oh, no, don't stab. Oh, the scissors, that's right. You should have made sure before you did something like that. Room. You had to make You're absolutely sure. All right, here we go. I've been waiting to see this. Oh. What is all the racket? What are you doing with Peter's car? He sold it to me. Oh. Like crap. Oh, so this is this is spreading. She's not stressed. Once it's like a illness. More people are coming in with fever and headache. What are we dealing with here? I don't know. It could be the flu. He passed out. What's going on? I wish I could tell you, Mrs. Shumway. Oh no! She's gonna drown in there. Oh my gosh! And that's one of my worst fears. Is everything normal? Nope. You're a mutant, like Wolverine. You know X-Men? <laughs> a lot of stuff. Nurse Adams said you'd be here. We need your help. Uh, what's going on? Can you tell me. We need your help. I'll need a mask and gloves before I examine We're out of both. Oh, this is uh, hitting a little bit too close to home right now. <laughs> what are you doing here? I got six, so Jim and I brought her in. Why? What are you doing here? And I'll, uh, I'll catch up with you. You're helping the guy who they punch each other out on? I have no idea what you're talking about. Through my stuff. You lied to me about having a fight with Junior Rennie. You owe me an explanation. Whoa, whoa. I'm okay. I just have a headache. Oh, Let's that... get her to the treatment area. I think we may have an epidemic on our hands. This damn dome, it's like an incubator. Your son probably got vaccinated when so did my family, so. Yeah, yeah, all you see is a vaccination home. Uh, what about uh -huh. those who didn't? These pharmacy. Listen, doctor. Give me a list of what you need. Go inside. Guard the door. Make sure no one gets out. Like a quarantine? Counting on you, Junior. The clinic is now closed. No one leaves. What the hell? Dr. Calvert. Linda's temp's 104 and Miss Moore's BP's falling. She's still gonna give it to her. She's gonna give it to her. Oh, yeah. I'll wait till the next round. James, 
you don't understand, I think that my husband might be in trouble. Bill said that he was meeting Peter in a cabin. Like the one I found Barbie at? What are you talking about? Oh. You need to let me out. I wish I could, but I can't. Try to find a way out? His wrath are you burns like fire. What the hell are you doing? He's the only one who decides who lives and dies under his dome. And there's nothing you can do about it. I love the car. What's happening? They gave you antibiotics. How are you feeling? I've been better. I had a lot of help, though, especially from Duke Perkins. May you rest in peace. But don't sell yourself short. Miss Moore? Oh. oh. Miss Moore? Help! We need help in here! You can't stop all of us with that gun. Step back. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Mr. Densmore, you remember when my mother died? And your wife, she made that amazing cornbread. Now I'm in here with you, with this, not to point a gun at you. And I'm one of you. I believe in this town. I believe in my dad. And I believe in you. Whoa. Meanwhile, he's got a girl drowning in his basement. Good job. It's a zoo out there. Thanks. The last time one happened was after we touched. Touch again? Yeah. We should film it. You ready? Let's do it. OK, I feel stupid. At the end of the Brown over here. So where's Julia? Not a clue, man. Is that the, is that the DJ? Oh, I remember that was him. About a month ago, he came to me asking if I knew any hitmen. Well, he yeah. asked you about hitmen. I know. And how much of this did you tell her? In the room. She's hallucinating. Why didn't you tell me? Nori, wake up. You feel anything? Well, let's check out the video. I'll rewind it. I don't get it. Oh, you can actually. Oh, shit. What the hell? Do you remember doing that? That's creepy. No. No way. Maybe we're not supposed to tell anyone. Because the dome doesn't want us to. What happened? What'd you tell her? I just mentioned the place I saw you a couple days ago. Give me the keys to your truck. No. Hey, now she left on your watch. So give me the keys to your truck. Oh, well, well, well. Look who came back from the dead. I heard you saved the day. Well, that's what I do. People were freaking out, and he talked them down. Chip off the old block. You ever consider a career in law enforcement? <laughs> that's what I look for. Was that you who saved my life? I learned about Peter in that cabin. So what were you all into? When I got out of the military, I did um, a bunch of odd jobs, uh, making sure that people paid what they owed. You're an enforcer. Guys like Phil owed. Peter never gambled? I've got the cash, but my wife's home. It's his voicemail from five days ago. So where is he now? He must have taken off. You know, that happens sometimes. Some of these guys, they get in so deep and... Damn it. You know, they skip town. I trusted you. When I get back home, you better be gone. This is the outbreak over. Well, everyone who's sick has been treated. What have you two been doing all day? Oh, you know, just making out and stuff. Right. <laughs> it's the stuff that usually worries us. It's just me, so you guys could stay there. Please don't say no. Thanks, Joe. That'd be great. I'll grab our stuff and meet you in the car. Thanks for the ride. <laughs> He's really got to get home. She died saving my life. She knew how important you are to this town. What you did today saved a lot of lives. Mrs. Moore was right. We have come a long way. Oh, no. Okay, get home. Get in your freaking basement. Where is, where is, where's your son? He came here to apologize. I'm going to wash my hands. It's a lot of money. He needs okay, God is punishing you. in jail for what you did today. You can't hurt me without hurting yourself. In other words, you take me down, I'm going to take you down with me. 
He's he thinks that the dome is punishment by God. Oh no, he's gonna find it. He's gonna go crazy. Oh, Junior's not gonna be not gonna be pleased to run after this. Oh no, don't stop right there. Damn it. Damn it. Oh man, you can't take that back now. Can't see that. Oh man, what a cliffhanger. Dad's not gonna like that. That's gonna change everything. Just when she thought this when she thought he thought he thought his son was he thought was he thought his he thought his son was doing the right thing and now it's all been ruined. Now the question is Will he side with his son or with law? Because he'd have to turn his son in. But I think he he's kind of a corrupt dude. So I think as much as he's probably going to beat up on his son. But at the same time, I feel like he's not going to do anything. I think he's going to protect his son from it. As much as he hates it. I don't know. Or maybe not. Or maybe he'll feel like he should be punished for it. But no, I think he's going to protect him. I think he's going to protect him. Oh, no. Oh, that's what's gonna happen. That's what's gonna happen, isn't it? He can't. He's. I thought he was gonna release her, but he can't, because if he releases her, it ruins the two of them. Well, it ruins the son anyway, for sure. And it might come out. It might the stick might kind of rub off on him. And he is kind of he's corrupt as it is. So you know what? Like father, like son, he's gonna help the father. He's gonna help his son. Oh, that's gonna be nasty. He's actually gonna. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna help his son to keep her in that basement. I know it. I know it. It's exactly what's gonna happen. I bet you. I bet you. That guy has already done corrupt stuff before that, so no surprise there. I think that's gonna happen. So, we uh, let's see. Julia followed the map, and she found her husband at the other end of it, and she found out more about Dale, Barm, aka Barbie. That he is actually some kind of debt collector. Well, I mean, like the enforcer type. I see what she put it. She's like a loan shark kind of thing. You know, she's a yeah, yeah. She's the guy who goes and collects the debts. Like Arthur Morgan in Red Dead Redemption 2. Awesome game. Eventually the brother is gonna realize something's happening there. At least he said something this episode, but we'll see. Speaking of which the brother uh is now with that hanging out with the uh, the chick and the moms, and then they're gonna they're gonna be living at his house for now. And the two the two of them get along really well. So they, they obviously like each other. There's, it's almost like destiny, you know? I mean, the dome brought them together. Something happening to them because they're going like, shh, and everything. Shh, what is that? I don't know. I don't know. But they think they got to keep it quiet. So I think they're going to start doing experiments to figure out what's happening to them. And I didn't realize that was Phil from the, uh, from the uh, what do you call it? The radio station? That was him, yeah? I went, oh, I didn't see the lady. But uh, the, I think it was the guy from the radio station. I didn't realize that. So that's why... The last episode when Julius said, you want to meet Phil, he said no and walked away because he already knew Phil. Is that it though? Is it he just a debt collector or is there more to his story? He went from military to debt collector. I don't know. But that was Under the Dome episode 4? Yeah. Yeah, things are getting heated up. Thank you guys for watching. It's been awesome. Can't wait for the next episode.